LM Studio, guys. This one is awesome. Like, what LM Studio is, guys, it's a local chat GPT, pretty much. Homepage, you can search for different models like, like Llama or, you know, whatever, Llama 2. A tip is to always get the GGML model. So if you look at me, this is the models I have. I have like two coding ones and just Llama. Llama 2 is like the best open source large language model. At the time I got it, it was at least quite slow, but we can test it out, guys, here. So yeah, I've already loaded platypus 2 we like write a poem about tech content creator on tiktok it isn't actually that slow i expected it to be a lot slower the creator's universe curating content a tiktok tech wizard mastering art in their digital studio capturing hearts sparking memes like laughter about what i think the coolest feature is that i haven't actually tested yet but we might test it right now and that is this local inference server so what you can do here is actually get LM Studio to host a server that runs any of these models and you can plug and play with OpenAI's library, right? So in like, for instance, on uh, one of my projects, Timestamp Genius, which I showed earlier, I use OpenAI's API to make the timestamps, right? And that uses the API, which costs money, but I can have it run locally without internet by using this server. And it's just as easy as setting the base path to whatever like the local server is here let's try that out i'm going to start the server i'm going to open timestamp genius i'm gonna run timestamp genius okay so now i have timestamp genius running locally and i'm gonna find where i make the open ai um call override base path oh that's it we did it we did it we did it base path yes Ooh, I'm excited. I hope this works. Face off this. Okay. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's test it. Let's test it out with the video. This one. Actually, boom. I don't know if this will work. Is it going to give an error? No errors so far. Ooh, look, we even see that it did work. It sent the thing to the server. Awesome. It's just going to be really slow, but that's fine as long as it works. Dude, that's so cool. It definitely hit the server, but I guess it's... Oh, there we go. It's, it's replying. Yes guys wow so here's the thing in theory now we can take all of these open source ai agents like devops gpt what else is open source like meta gpt gpt assistant all these all these models that use open ai api on the back end we can replace open api with our local models so we don't have to do we don't have to pay and we don't have to be online so we could run like these AI AI agents offline now the ones that use open AI just like really quickly just by configuring the base path so that's super exciting obviously it's not as good and nowhere near as fast but but the potential is there for 